Hi, I'm Penny Gomez and welcome to the award-winning pop. It's Penny on Point with profiles on persons of interest. You notice that I'm holding a glass in my hand because this is the Christmas episode. Love Christmas. As usual, with all our shows, we don't leave you out of the action. You can go online before showtime, guess who's coming on the show, and a lucky person who guesses correctly wins a prize compliments of our friends at Hadco. We are here at Mountain View Maracas, and we have a fantastic show planned for you. That's right. If you've ever looked back at any of our Christmas episodes, you know, lots of action because it's Christmas time. So expect everything from paranderos to... You never know. And lots of challenges in store for our guests. So we are so looking forward to this and glad to have you on board with us. Yep, it's about that time. I hear a doorbell. It's Myron B, the Parang Soka boss himself. Welcome to Pop. Good morning, good morning, good evening, good night. Hello, everybody. <laughs> did you guess correctly? If you did, there's a prize with your name and it compliments of a friend at Hadco. We're ready for you. Let me go. I have one of these waiting for you. And I will deal with it as soon as we get Well, it. you're the vibes man, so let's you go. know. Let's let's see. It's Christmas. One time. Vibes in the house. Neighbor, neighbor, okay. whoa, <laughs> neighbor, yeah, yeah. And we are here on Pop with Myron B. Myron, I promised you a drink at the door, so cheers. Cheers. Christmas 2022. 2022. And all the best for the new year. Of course, and beyond. And beyond. <laughs> so it's so great to have you really on Pop. I tell you, you walked through that door and I felt like Christmas. I mean. Even if I wasn't feeling it before, but, I felt it. But you look like Christmas, my goodness. <laughs> like a whole Merry Christmas. A whole Merry you, Christmas. You know the little, the little cherry that has gone on top of the black uh -huh. My goodness. Mm, you see why this man <laughs> won the most humorous Calypso competition for about six years in a row, right? Oh six my. times? Six times. Six times because he's making fun of me. I just, that's what the whole point of that. Oh, my goodness. But, <laughs> <laughs> well, Myron, even before we get started, I want to say that um, last um, season on Pop, mm -hmm. for our last Christmas show, we had Kenny J pass through. Mm-hmm. And it was really a beautiful season, uh, that particular show for us. And when Ken, when Kenny came, we challenged him because, you know, he was talking about the house and mm. rushing the house. So mm -hmm. we set him a challenge to see if he could really paint. Yes. And he did. Uh -huh. Of course. And who <laughs> knew that he was also a talented artist? My goodness. And on the spot, he painted that house. And today that house, the painting is here in Pops. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, in our Pop set. And here it is. We will forever, you know, keep Kenny's this house, close right? to us. Kenny's house, Kenny's house, Kenny's house. Looking like his house down separate, all the fruit trees around. You know, it, you know, it's true. Yeah. As a house, you can <laughs> say that. But, um, and we just want to dedicate this show to him. Yes. Um, you know, may his soul rest in peace. But, but Kenny, this is for you. This pop is for you. And we bring the Parang boss himself on the show, just in your <laughs> memory. So, I'm going to put this back here because this is very cherished yes. on the set. Signed by Kenny J, mind you. <laughs> so I'm just going to, you know what? I'm just going to hold it, hold it close to me. I'm going to keep it close right there. All right. Yes. So Myron B, or should I be calling you Calypsonian, Calypso Knight? Because I hear a whole name change. <laughs> Guys, if you notice, oh his hair, he has no more locks. Yeah, go on, boy. Uh, what happened there? What happened? Well, uh, I mean, coming into arts and entertainment, this year would be... I'm celebrating 20 years as a professional entertainer. Right. Uh -huh. Started very young. And as we look forward to where art and entertainment and culture is going to be in the next 20 years, since about 2009, my team and I realized that we need to make an adjustment to accommodate the entertainment, art and entertainment in the future. And one of the things that we looked at is the world was getting smaller. Mm -hmm. More people are getting access to us. And the, the demand for attention and identity is very critical. So we decided to put together a new artistic brand or artistic brand concept that would best represent who I am as a person, what our culture is, and what we want the world to see us as. So hence, the, this is where Calypso Night was born. Mm -hmm. Right now, night is not night as night in shining armor, it's but night rather night. a cool, breezy yeah. calypso night. Yeah. Right. So when we looked at what 
entertainment is going to be like 20, 30 years from now. And the markers that we now have the ability to leave today, right? Because generations from today would now have all the hashtags. They would now have all of the digital footprints to look back on and to reference. We want to be at the front of that entire experience that generations from now are going to have when they look back at Trinidad and Tobago and they see this artistic brand, right? They're supposed to know that this is Calypso, this is Trinidad and Tobago, this is who we are. And since, I mean, the transition was long in coming, right? We were looking at it since I said 2009. And when the, just before the pandemic hit, we said, okay, this is it, we're going to switch now. And then pandemic came. The hair was a part of that too? No, no, no. I just wake oh. up in the morning and say, all right. A vap The spirits say, all right, it's time to, to shake it up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and you decided to just cut your locks. One time. That was way past your bottom, right? Yeah, yeah. All by, by my thighs. Mm, yeah. By your thighs. Yes. I still have oh. it, though, yeah. Uh -huh. I think I might frame it and frame it. paint it. Uh, artistic. Paint and do something with nice of it. I could see that. <laughs> <laughs> so, Myron, you have straddled both the pure Calypso mm -hmm. and then, of course, Parang Soka. Yes. Do you have a preference? Ooh, well, that's an interesting story, yeah? You see, when I started, the intention was to be the baddest soccer artist on the planet, mm -hmm. right? But also represent the culture of Trinidad and Tobago. And when I, I was looking at ways to get into the commercial space, because I got my first break doing humorous calypso mm -hmm. and performing comedy, right? But when it was time to get on the commercial recording side, I looked left and right and I saw the only window of opportunity was in Parang because at the time, we just had the big four, Marcia, Crazy, Kenny, Scrunter, mm -hmm. really putting out work in the season. They had a couple other people on the fringes and that looked like a clear open road. And what I did, I was able to get into that space and, you know, inject some of the humor that I was doing otherwise and comedy into the soccer parang space and carve a, a decent niche for myself. Now, if I'm to say which do I prefer, I do see them as, a, as anything different because it's the same type of um, fun that I would have with Calypso that I just bring to the parang space. Oh, okay. But if, I, if, if you are you're going to ask which of the two seasons or energies I prefer, yes, for I sure. have to say Christmas. Really? <laughs> yes. Okay, and... And this humorous clips of competition that he's won, guys, not once, twice, but six times, I want to mention. Yes. Uh, do you think you're naturally funny? Do you have to work at it? No, uh, I was born that way. I got that from my mother. That... <laughs> Again, he is showing why he, why he is a champion. Yes. The, um, I mean, humor comes natural, natural to me, right? Mm. Being funny, I, I don't have to try, right? And writing funny songs with... All of that came from my early days of reading. I started reading a little too early, mm -hmm. right? And I was always intrigued by books and the stories and where this goes and where this thing. And then when imagination stepped in and, you know, we think about an idea, it's, you start thinking about where this could go, what could happen next. And I would start laughing to myself. And then I started putting these down as short stories when I was a child. So I used to put on the cassette thing and press record. Cassette, yes. Cassette, yeah. Cassette. I come uh -huh. from the eighties. Uh -huh. <laughs> I used to press the, the um press record anything and just start telling a story. Both sides. When I fully tape, I listen to it over, laugh to myself, rewind it and do our next one. And then you put tracks to that you started putting music. No, no track no tracks to the stories. Nah, mm -hmm. that is when I was like nine, ten mm -hmm. as a child. And that storytelling is what evolved into the um I, w I wasn't trying to be a humorist. I wasn't trying to be a comedian. That was never part of the division. And I wrote one funny song back in 1997 or something like, sometime like that. I was looking at a, um, a show on TV with you know, a talent thing on the promenade. Everybody was going and singing the Whitney Houston and all of that. And you see the crowd stand up stiff. And I say, you know, if I go there, I'll just sing a funny song. Yeah. I just make people laugh and make people enjoy themselves. And I went and I picked up my, um, my father guitar at the time. And I played the three chords that I knew. And I wrote a funny song called Hard Times. And that was the beginning of my humorous calypso. Well, and you're, you're not at all shy when it comes to representing a character because one of those <laughs> mono competitions, you came on full in full dress. Yes, yes. So yes. it's anything to... No, no any, anything goes. Distance. No, that, that one was, I mean, it was a story. Yes. Now, I was thinking about, okay, what, what, what kind of funny scenario would, could I paint for the audience? And I was thinking, imagine if I get trapped in a house and a drunk man come home. 
and I have to pretend to be his wife. And what a blind would happen? man. Well, the, the drunk man That's ended blind. up becoming a blind oh, man. Okay. That was the story evolved. That That's was the, the initial story. idea, right. right? And when I started visualizing what could happen next, now imagine the man say, come, let me go out, and he had to put on the lady dress. Oh, God. Imagine if police hold you. <laughs> oh gosh, imagine if he said, come, let me go and take a drink and dies your, the, the, your watering hole. Yeah. Where all your partners just be like, and they see you walking in this dress, right? And that man, that that was my very first humorous calypso that mm -hmm. got me um, an award. Yes, well, you know, you we give out awards here to one popper. Oh, really? I just want you to know that you may be walking away with one. I don't know. Uh -huh. You know, you have to prove yourself here in pop. <laughs> but he's oh, ready for it, guys. <laughs> Very articulate Myron B, who is also extremely humorous. Humorous. Stay with us. There's more coming in your way on this Christmas episode of Pop. Joy with Angostura. Hello, everyone. I just wanted to share something I discovered. This is an all local line, Ambrosia Cosmetics. Using it for the very first time. It's not even launched yet, so you are really getting the scoop on this. They have everything. It's the foundation, it's the um, compact powders, highlighters, um, lippies, the, the um, of course, the eye colors. You can't go wrong with it. Fantastic product. Vegan free and, of course, free from animal cruelty. Best thing about it is all the, uh, the eye colors range of our colorful Caribbean and it can go from nine to five and of course after 5 p.m. for that nighttime adventure. Belle's Beauty in the house with us. Belinda from Belle's Beauty, she's created a Christmas look for our pop show. What did you do? I've used the nude colors in this palette. We have a number of palette colors to choose from. We have bright colors for carnival, but for Christmas we chose a smoky eye to complement the red. We also use gorgeous fitting for penny on point today and it actually accentuates the look of the smoky eyes okay so we are popping on set with ambrosia products okay guys i think it's ready for the show time see you later and we're back in pop it's the christmas episode so you know enough excitement happening here myron b what's Boy. your favorite a, a Christmas memory. Oh gosh, I have so much, so much. I have. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Child. I hear doorbell. But but I find like I'm hearing a quattro or a mandolin, something. You know it's Christmas time, right? So when it comes to the pop Christmas show, anything could happen. And our door is apparently open to everyone. <laughs> yeah. oh, hey. Hey, Look who we have here. <laughs> Look who Merry we Christmas. Have here. It's La Mancia, my name is Enrico. <laughs> Come into Parang, your house. Enrico! Hey. Enrico Cabello! Sereno, Sereno! Sereno! It's a sound Sereno. De la Madruga. Si, sí, senor! <laughs> Uh, Enrico Cabello, oh, how, how you fight? How you find us? I you see with these paranderos. When all the go... cars come in here, I to be here. I had to parang this house. This is what the paranderos do. Out the house. Bro brothers. <laughs> yeah, brothers. Yes, yes. This is parang my brother so her brothers. My Enrico Cabello, welcome to Pop. Thank you very much. It's glad. I'm glad to be here. I'm glad to be here. Oh, I, goodness. This is my brother. We have been recording. Play something. Play something. Play something. Give me. Give no, me no, no. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Yeah, yeah. Imagine. Imagine. Give a G. You see, yeah, this, yeah. Is what, this is what happens and pop. Anything happens. We have it, huh? Yes. All right. Well, right now, as we can see. There goes my interview segment, guys. Around <laughs> with me. Yeah. You're going to enjoy this one. 
with Myron and Lamancia. Hey. <laughs> he come down here real happy, ringing pong for everybody. Woo. Tell you right now, we can't stop. Myron and we go here on pop. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Yeah, Parang, Parang, <laughs> Soka, X Tempo at its yes, best, man. guys. You brought the vibes. He had vibes already. Plus you, and you know, you are the vibes, man. Parang, Soka, man. Oh, but listen, man. for those of you who don't know, oh, Enrico, I call him Rico, <laughs> he is very well known in wearing so many hats. One of the hats, Bungie Garland, you know, with Bungie and his yes. band. With, with um, his official guitarist for the past 13 years. 13 wow. years. Yes. And he is a man who has all those antics on oh. stage. <laughs> we all know him for those antics. He's very vibrant when he performs. But he also has a company called Music Mansion. Yes. And he also has Parang Bancos, La Mansion. Actually, La Mansion is part of the music mansion. It's yes. the parang room the parang in, the, room. in the mansion. Yeah, the mansion has many rooms. You are talking about. Yeah. And Enrico does so many other things, guys, but he's joined us here because he's also the president of the Parang Association. I am not the president. <laughs> I'm a big I, walker, sorry. I am, I am a trustee director, he's a, tr he's a director, sorry. Yes, trustee director. Of the, of the Parang Asha Association. Parang. And how do you do this? Because you, I mean, you are so busy and you, you're you doing so many things. I, you ask my family, you ask everyone in the enti in different entities, they, they ask the same question. I do not know. I just have energy to help to serve musical, musically. Yes. And, you know, it, it just keeps me going. And, and I guess it keeps me looking young as well. Yes. <laughs> you know, because I'm, I'm nearing to 50 soon. Yes. So, but I enjoy um, just giving service, especially at Christmas time. Christmas time is parang time. It's, parang it's soca time. parang time. It's, 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 there's nothing like a Trini Christmas. And I was just about to ask that, gentlemen, because when you think about things unique to us, mm -hmm. you yes. know, what is, it, what is particularly unique to a Trini Christmas? Trin Bingo. Let's not forget Tobago. Mm -hmm. Trin Bingo. <laughs> Trin Bingo yeah. Christmas. Christmas. I think that, yes. yes. Because Tobago love the parang as well, yeah. of course. You know, we almost had someone from Tobago here for the, for our um, NPAT competitions and, I think we're going to go to Tobago next year, for sure. I yeah. know they love their parang a yeah. lot. You've been to Tobago? Of course. I, I have a song celebrating Christmas. Of course. Tobago. Yes, <laughs> right. yes, yes, right. yes. He does. Yeah. Music again. It's I'm just going to turn this out to the end of your segment, now guys. It's all over. Go. Oh, oh. It's Christmas in Tobago. Are we drinking, oh lad? It's Christmas in Tobago. Are we paranging, oh lad? It's, it's Christmas, Christmas in Tobago. Tobago. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we passed that. Well, I shouldn't say we passed a dreadful pandemic, but we're seeing, at least we've seen the light yes, emerging from that. What are you looking forward this year? Do you find there's so much more activity because people want to get out? They want to actually, in person, have that camaraderie. I, I think right now what we're seeing is a nation that was begging to exhale. Yes. yes. Right? That That's what it feels like when you know, having gone out to some events so far for the season. Um, we have people that have been, they, they, they gender, generally feel as if they have been starved of their breath, Correct. right? Mm -hmm. Correct. Because Christmas, I mean, for the past two Christmases, it has been hard. Some people tried some things. We all did a lot of virtual work. It was hard. Yes, right? But of course, they, we had hard. no touching and feeling. No, no. Right? <laughs> and different. when going out to the events now, we are seeing that people are so happy to have the freedom to come out and express themselves and be together as they used to, right? We still have a lot of caution, yes, right? We, we, we have seen a lot of the protocols from the pandemic come continue. over into the uh, continuing And you know what? We can't go wrong with that. I think that's a good thing to yeah, do. Yeah, 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 definitely, yes. right? Uh, especially, I mean, they can't touch a mic now because have somebody they're Probably. sanitizing it, <laughs> right? So we've become a more hygienic society yes. a, a bit. But we still like, uh, imagine a dry, dry sponge mm -hmm. that after two months, no getting water, they're just yes. sucking up everything. Yes. On our, our, our society, we're just sucking up everything. Look, right now for, for Carnival, I mean, this is a Christmas edition, but for Carnival, most frontline suits are, are sold out already. Yes. Yeah. Most bands and, you know, the events come in, you know, um, hotels have been booked out for the Carnival season already. Let's talk about that in the carnival. <laughs> right, but, but you know what the good thing about it is? You're in the Christmas season, and I know I can talk to you all again in the carnival season. Of course. Yes, so, because yeah. you transcend both seasons. Oh, yes. yes. Okay, but what I want you to transcend now, I want to see how you transcend in terms of 
a pop and fashion because both you men are known for, you know, you know, Rico, when you take that <laughs> stage and it come out for them, you know, you take that very seriously. Yes, I do. Yes, we do. So, yes, and, of course. And so does Myron. Yes. So I want to know what you all think about some of the fashion that we have here in what we call our pop or flop segments. Okay. All right, gentlemen. Mm, what do you popping. think about this? Popping like me. Right? Yeah. Pop. yeah. That is a so pop. That is a Myron. Yes, ma'am. That's yes. a get up for you. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so a pop. That's a flop for me. Really? I You're love. not into the sweaters? Mm. I'm not into the loud prints. Eh? Yeah. Not into the loud prints. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So flop. Lord have mercy. And uh, this could be really good on stage, but I will do this. <laughs> you see? Yeah. For one of your acts. Of, right? course. of course. No, I wouldn't mind doing this yeah. either. I would do imagine, something imagine. like that. Yeah, like I would never do it. Candy cane, cane mandolin. Yeah. <laughs> what about this? No way. <laughs> Rico, you're sure a bungee doing a, a Christmas show. I'll have to go to the gym up. first. I'll need a four months in the gym first. <laughs> four months. Comes. Well, I'm... Um, yeah, I'm messy. Um, what about this? Not bad, you know. Not bad, but, but for the hats. Me, what, what do you think, Byron? Oh, what are those hats? It's so nice. It's, it's, it's a little too hidden, man. You see, the, the one before, I, I, I might do that. Yeah, the one before. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, All right, man. next one. <laughs> hmm. I'm shocked. Nobody likes this. Mm. I am taken aback at this. Um, it's I wear that on a normal day. It's it's yeah, oh, it's, it's like yeah. it's like going to the grocery. It's like going to the grocery. I yeah, see what yeah, you're saying. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Uh huh. All right. If it's in foreign end, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so you're gonna rock this in in a foreign. Of course. Yes. Of course. Definitely. Oh. Definitely. Oh no. <laughs> Those glasses are Christmas glasses. I know. Um, I I think it's a face that's not. Um, it's a face that's not right. The glasses yes. okay. <laughs> so you will go with the glasses, but yeah. <laughs> okay. Why does he have to? Woo! This is a flop. No, I can't say flop. You know why? You say uh, I, I, why, why just that? the other day I said, you know, I should do a suit with Christmas lights and decorations on it for Look content. Look at that! Peace. You never. <laughs> <play>. <laughs> so nice. <laughs> you it's so nice. Day, it's so nice. You can get away with that. Hey, right. hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Aaron, you may get your wish today. You never know. Don't say that. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> it's come true and pop. Um. Hmm. No, let me tell you. <laughs> this is what you would call a conversation piece. Yes. yes. When you wear that, they'll say, boy, I remember the man who come with the, looking like the, um, the leprechaun <laughs> with, the, with, the, with, the, with the Christmas boots. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I would do that. I would do that. Normal. Um, and, and Rico, has um, to think about that. So, pop for you. Pop for you. Uh, next, next. But pop for you. Next, pop. Yeah, next. next one. Okay. And right, that's that it. Was that's it. Well, oh, man. Should have some more. But... Well, did well. We're just getting started, you know, guys, because more things happening. You know, we do it on pop. Oh, my goodness. Bring you have your command. mandolin. So let me get something to go before the break now. All right, let's go. Something. Keep that right there. Right. You want me to stay inside a little mm -hmm. longer. Stay inside a little longer. You're hearing Pyrang playing. Look, Rico jamming. Ooh. Calypso night singing. We gonna stay inside a little mm -hmm. longer. But Penny will stay inside yeah. a little longer. longer. <laughs> look, the wine was popping, parang music playing, and, and look how beautiful driving. our host is looking. Oh, Lord, yeah, stay yeah. inside a little <laughs> longer. <laughs> Say, stay inside <laughs> a little longer. Back, guys, aye, aye, aye. let's break. <laughs> Christmas coming here is all around. Christmas back in town. Christmas coming here is all around. Christmas is coming, and your fingers know it. For a finger licking good Christmas, KFC. Everybody to get together and do something like this. Let's get you ready. Let me go. It's painted time.
This is the Christmas edition, and they are playing one of my favorite Soka Parang songs by Kenny J, and we have dedicated this show to his memory. Yes. Guys, you see where we are? We're in the kitchen. Oh, lovely. We That's have music. Nice. We have drinks. You have your yellow tail, um, your Moscato, Moscato, compliments of our friends at Hadco. You have your LLB. Beautiful. You, you're drinking on the soft side. Yes. Compliments <laughs> of Angostura. We're happy yes. about that. You know what we're missing now? We're missing, uh, we're missing something soiled. Something That's it. Soy. I come up around the place saying, nothing soit yet. Something uh -huh. What will you do for that, Penny? <laughs> we, we can solve that problem. That's, oh, yes. That's this is when we call on Chef Katie ah. of Abbeville Catering. Oh, my goodness. He's joining us. Come on. Yes. Where is... Ah, uh, there he is. <laughs> Katie, yeah. For the last two years, you have been giving us fantastic meals to liven up our, our Christmas offerings, our tables. What do you have for us this year? Well, I... These guys ready to eat, eh? Oh, yes. Well, I have a good treat for y'all. So I pull out a secret recipe for y'all for ah. this Christmas season. And, and I notice you have a whole box of them. Yes, but I, um, I do want Ooh. you to go inside. <laughs> <laughs> it's a secret. It's a secret. Right. So this year we're going to have a fantastic mm. jerk ham. Jerk ham. Jerk ham. Caribbean jerk ham. That, that's different. That's what I taste everything Of course. Would you, you like to try it? No. I, we, I think so we So let's go to the oven. That. Right now it should be ready. I, uh, yeah. Well, it looks sumptuous. Oh, my goodness. Let me just have you close That is ham. Oh. Oh. <laughs> if only you could smell it now. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay. The test, the test is in the cotton, so let's see. Let's see how, how succulent So, So how, how was this done? Besides, you, you know, what you did? What you did? So what we did, honestly... Um, the marination of the ham actually happened. We injected with my own Jama Jamaican, I call it Jamaican, own jerk seasoning, right? Mm -hmm. And we also rub it down for about, it stayed there for about probably 20 minutes mm -hmm. before it started the baking okay. process. Okay. So when we slice inside of it, we're actually going to find some jerk seasoning, jerk flavors all inside of the ham. So we have Ooh. the flavors both outside and inside. Fully infused. Oh. Fully, Fully infused. infused. <laughs> and, and meanwhile, we want to be infused with some of it ourselves. Yes. So let's try it. And how long do you bake for? Oh, so three and a half hours. Three and okay. a half. Okay. Dry. So while I'm preparing my, my house and so on, I could have that ham in the oven baking. And... Definitely. Yeah. Okay. You know, and the, you know, if you want to get the, you, well, I make my own jerk season. But I'm sure that there's several supermarkets. Well, hey, you, know, hey, you spoke the magic words because just in case you don't have Appleville catering, KD seasoning, <laughs> you can try the, the Grace Jamaican jerk seasoning and it comes in mild and, um, and hot. So you have your option, you know, if depending on 
and what the taste buds can take. So, ooh, spot. ooh, that looks that looks good. Yes, ooh, that looks so good. I, and my mouth is watering. My mouth is watering. <laughs> Bring out the ham. Bring out the ham. And we have a little boat that we're sweeping in. Woo! The ham sailing. The ham is sailing into <laughs> our mouths. The ham is sailing there. Woo! That looks really good. That really looks good. good. That looks good. Succulent. Ay, ay, ay. Thank you. Thank you. I'm recording. I'm coming have, away because I, I know. I'll have clips tonight. I, yeah, sure, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Yeah. <laughs> sorry, sorry that he does not eat meat, but we okay. We okay with it. <laughs> we okay with it. Mm -hmm. Ready to taste? Okay, Rico? let's go. I, I can do the count. One, mm. two. Oh, you done happen already. <laughs> <laughs> My goodness. Mm. Mm. Fantastic. Wow. <laughs> wow. This ham is a whole show by itself. Mm -hmm. My goodness. So do you want to... Mm -hmm. My Christmas season has begun. Jerk ham, <laughs> everything. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. That is happening. Succulent. Have you been eating something to wash it down, it though? Melts, it's almost melts in your mouth. It, it does. But then we could be bringing yeah. things to wash it down, though. Oh. What do you have, Penny? Mm-hmm. <laughs> We have, of course, the Angostura, Angostura the, the, the chill, yes. but yeah, mm -hmm. the sorrel. So, guys, you know, you have to try that. You have to wash it down with that something. Mm. Right. Bring one for you, too. Of course. Bring one this for is you. amazing, Chef. Thank you. <laughs> You're missing out. Uh, yeah, well, more for you, I guess. Thanks. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> there you go. There you go. Nice. Nice. Yes. Oh, I, should actually, yes. I should actually bring one for Chef as well, too, right? Yes. Chef, I'm I have one. I have one right here. Okay, there you go. There you go. So, guys, compliments of the season again. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Everybody. Mm -hmm. Cheers. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, um... Oh, that is lovely. Thank you. That is lovely, but... Eh, why in the midst of all this are here in a doorbell? Well... I um, know I'm not expecting anyone. Mm -hmm. No, because I'm here already. And yeah. Calypso Knight is here as well. So then who could be here then? Wonder who that could be. Okay, well then I, I think we need to one find out, right? Let me find out. Let me find out who I know. Enrico, get side. La Valencian, welcome guys. This is my band, La Valencian. up in here on pop so la mansion you didn't join us in time we still have ham that you can get but added to that we know a dessert oh, so we have a hagen das ice cream for wow. dessert you know and listen they have two new flavors the the flavors are already i tried to pick them up can even get them because they're such a high demand it is the irish whiskey with the chocolate waffle and then they have the salted caramel rum and biscuits so I have to tell you that um, that is that is ice cream. That is yeah, it's for the season. But we don't have those. We are going to enjoy our vanilla and we're going to enjoy our sorbet. Oh, so so I feel that, um, you know, we need to get some more music before we go to break again. Okay? Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. What shall we do? Let's do this. <laughs> i 
from break talk about a sweet session with La Mansion Myron B we had a time in the kitchen with him and Rico Myron B has gone off to cakes it's Christmas time no problem so I am taking this opportunity guys they don't know this is happening okay I am taking this opportunity to do what we call the ugly t-shirt competition the challenge you know they have ugly sweater but we have no snow here we're not cold as a matter of fact we are hot so I decided to do an ugly t-shirt competition. This is the twist. Are you all ready? They're going to be shocked too. Don't worry. You know, there's always a surprise and pop. I would like to invite our producer, Colin Graves. Please join us. Yes, I know you're shocked. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I, come you know on. I feel about this. <laughs> Colin is joining us. I'm throwing out a, a challenge to the cast and crew. Come oh. on this side. Come, come right here. Oh. You know, Colin. Colin, Colin, pick your team because it's my team against your team. Pick your team, please. I have dibs. Kimmy, you're on my team. Come in quick. <laughs> Sorry, you've lost Kimmy. I picked you number John. <laughs> <laughs> hey, put on that camera and come over here. <laughs> no, next camera, man. John O. Yeah, jo I John O. John O, John O, you're yeah. up. Jo okay, then. Really? John O. <laughs> Yeah, John is spilling his John face. John with the KFC. But but I know I'm yeah, not all on I told the segment was my lunch break. Bed, John, <laughs> <laughs> John is with the must have of KFC because we know what it's like, guys, having to prepare for Christmas, those long hours of work. Nothing does it better than when you're working and you have your Jono, Jono, Jono. Sorry, yeah. Sorry. This is what the KFC will do. And I understand that you want to eat your KFC. All right. I just need something to, from my brain to focus on this because I know you're coming with some kind of surprise. Well, here. this is it, right? So we are doing ugly T-shirt. Mm -hmm. One of you, you know how you know how important this this trophy is. None of them. None of them. That we will compete in for pop truth. Colin, Colin, I think this is our trophy, you know. I claim. I actually never thought we would ever. I don't know. We end up competing. Colin, Colin, yeah, yeah. This is our early Christmas present. But think, think, think of this on your 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 cupboard on your shelf for Christmas, and somebody comes in. This this is bragging rights on set. And sees this, and you can say my team. And every time you look at Kimmy, every time you look at him, you see. Yeah, that's what so we Penny, do. So, who Penny, who's judging this? Right, so this is the other twist. You will be judged by a panel of your peers. So, <laughs> the rest of the crew gets to decide who wins this competition. Wink, 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 wink. I just want to hey, just remember, I am your drop bonus. home, eh? There's a special bonus. I am your you drop choose, home. I just, you as well. I drop in all the home. I just see right now. Wow. <laughs> so, the, these are the rules. Everybody, T-shirt up. I oh, know this isn't everybody. There are four of us and there are three T-shirts. So yeah, we I... don't worry about that. That's his pair. So, Kimmy, this is our T-shirt. Hold your T-shirt up, please. Jono, these are the this. rules. These are the rules. You must use at yeah. least five of the items on this table. Five. So you can't be planning and strategizing and 
One item must be gold. Are you making this as you go along? Okay. <laughs> I see. Pop. This song is very hard. I thought that's what we did on pop. pop. Yeah. I thought that's what we did on pop. So. Um, but, but Colin, this wasn't any script that I got on him. No, no. This is Penny this. script. It's Penny on point. So one you must know? be gold. One must be gold. One must be red. One must be green. Penny t-shirt red. You will be awarded special points for or <laughs> no whispering on set. You'll be awarded special points for incorporating the theme. And the theme is... <laughs> she makes it up. <laughs> and she keeps trying to make it up as we go along. Okay. Uh, and the, and the theme seconds. is Christmas in Toko. In Let's Toko? go. Let's go. All right, hold on. Let's what? go. There's a good Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, Mm -hmm, yeah. Look, something what? cool. Look, something cool here. <laughs> something cool. Somehow this is going to be very hard. I take it all of this. Okay, Mika, use this. I <laughs> wrap this around here <laughs> soon. Oh, cool. There's plenty. Oh, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's, that's something cool. something <laughs> Okay, so this is harder than I realized. <laughs> oh, <huh? laughs> Kimmy's giving cool me things I know green. I don't know how to green. do. Yeah. So, so this is going up? Right? So that's something green, so stick down. I think this is... Oh, and how, what, 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 just, what are the colors we need? Oh, oh, red. Oh, okay, so I decided... Oh, straight down. <laughs> I think I might be failing, but Kimmy's trying to save me. Yes, sir. <laughs> like a big... So what are you all doing over job. there? You don't study that now, Miss Lady. We make it a Kimmy, look, but the, Kimmy, Kimmy make it a table, what? I may want to switch teams. I think so. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No, no, look, looky bad, this, this young. Thing here. You that, know, that Santa Claus don't have hair. Santa Claus have a beard. Santa Claus. Okay, this, this is going over. You have a big hair and beard. Right. Oh, oh, I see what you did. Oh, hey! Oh my yeah. goodness! Kimmy has a whole vibe across here. Do I need blue? Yeah, we need blue. Let me cut the hat. I will make a hat. Kimmy, I have to admit, I do not know how to because use a hat. You just press the up the sun too. You trigger yeah. Press the sun. You can tell I don't do this often. I want to swap on my TV. Somebody else on the set. I'm calling again. Point. Press the trigger. I wrong. Okay, I okay. So Penny does not know how to do this. I have to do it quick. Okay, quick, quick, quick. Get the glue done. Okay, ready? quick. The glue done. No, I think. Okay. Was the other thing red, gold, and green and what? Penny uh, can't remember. Uh, Penny can't okay, remember you, because you don't need to remember. remember. You don't, you don't need to remember. You see, there's, oh. there's only something when right, the person so who's writing the scripts, then they write the script now, so we don't know what's going on. Right. Would so you write this one in? Not going through. Oh. So these, okay, we, we, we have a... You're very good at our glue gun. So we good there. So, there we go. Uh -huh. We okay. one toko vibes. Okay, so you do something and put some glue? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta do it fast. Right, fast. Fast, fast, um, fast, um, fast, fast. We got space on the t-shirts. Right. So we can make the C too. Ah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The C. Is that enough? The ocean. No? So hold on, you 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 stay right. down right. and I go make a palm tree. Okay, here we Colin, go. I go make a palm tree for the Look, they, they have real stuff happening that, across your kids. You can't study them, them. Okay, so we got a green and golden yeah. one then. Yeah. Mm, boom shot. You see? You see what I'm talking about? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Because the time frame on this, I find it taken long. All right. Can we? Can we? Because you know, when you have the time, keep all working on the set, there's nobody's keeping time, right? Yeah, of course, that's not the right color. Oh, how could you take up a whole tinsel? Come on! Are you making up rules on this spot? All right, all right, all right, all right. Wait, I got it. Ooh! Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh! The tide is high. <laughs> and the pressure is on. This, this is um, a palm tree. Right. It's a palm tree for the tooth. <laughs> pressure, pressure, pressure. <laughs> pressure. Make sure it's pressure. Make sure it's Fine right. Glue gun. What else? What else? What else? Sure you make sure it stays. All right, yeah. fine. Oh, good, oh, good, oh, good. Yeah. Right. Hold on, John. Oh, John. Oh, oh, my, oh my goodness. Damn. Damn. Stick it on. Finish, boy. You ever see a palm tree with orange and... Ow! Oh, oh gosh. Hurry, 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 hurry. Somehow this seems a lot harder than people just think, eh? I know. I Especially like when you're under pressure. Oh, oh God. Hurry. Oh, oh, That's it. Okay. You stick it up? Wait, can we put some? Yes, it's good, it's good, it's good, it's good, it's good. All oh, right, 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 right. Stick it up. Oh my goodness, guys, we're almost out of time. Ten, we Ten, Ten, hurry up, give me, hurry up, hurry up. Oh Just... God, oh, I'm feeling so parang because I feel like I win. <laughs> oh God. We win. Hurry up, give me, hurry up. What? Oh, hurry up. <laughs> Boom, bam. You guys have this. <laughs> Boom, bam. Yeah, John. Right. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh that was oh, action. Oh, oh, oh. oh, child. Woo. Eh. Okay, so Penny, uh, do you want us to go first? Cause oh, you wanna? 
I, <laughs> well, we'll have to rethink when we give people challenges to do, but, but Kimmy and I, mm -hmm. uh, I'm afraid to pull it down. <laughs> Kimmy, mm -hmm. with, with confidence, we raise our T-shirt. Yeah. Da -da -da -da! I just want to say... Oh, this is so uninspiring. Hold this on. is... It, it feels very... I've seen this Hold before. on, like, we're part of the team too, so we get a judge on your own? I just want to say I, it feels that very, this I is... This I, I give it a 5 out of 10. I just want to say, for those of you who don't recognize it, this is the lighthouse in Toko mm -hmm. that we have highlighted here, mm -hmm. and we've made sure that it's it's lit because it is a symbol in the community. Yes, it's good. And and it can pass for a bottle. Can, it can can pass for a bottle. bottle. Yes. Right. And then, of course, the bow. Ah. Then, of course, the red bow signifying Christmas mm -hmm. and the meaning of Christmas and the festivity and its significance. And this you're little white thing is just for so. <laughs> if there's one thing, she can real talk it up. <laughs> you're good enough. She can real talk But I don't up. think it might be good enough today. Eh? Cool, cool. Are you finished? That's it. We are finished. True, yeah. 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 Okay, okay, okay. Thank you very much. All right. So now, Jono, we present. This is. What is this? This is. What is this? This is Uncle Toko Loco. Uncle Toko Loco. Basically, wow. what has happened? This is the Caribbean Santa Claus. Santa Claus came down from the North Bull to the Caribbean. He's having such a good time. But he decided to keep a little vibes, right? So ah. there's the Santa bear. This is his nose. You see, it's a tropical. I see no nose, nose up in there. There's eyes, there's eyebrows. We have a Toko Kobo flying over in the air. <laughs> you know, if you've ever been to Toko, we have a nice palm tree and wow, a nice palm tree hat. Because yeah. we know Matura and Toko and that whole North Coast vibes, what we've also done is look at the beautiful waves breaking wow. with the leatherback turtle <laughs> coming in. <laughs> Santa Claus, look, what? two leatherback turtles. You can sell breeze. So, Jono, I feel like this has been a masterpiece. Look, it's a pleasure Colin. working with you, Picasso. Colin, we could auction this off and get big money, you know? I believe wow. so. Right, right. And this is what happens right. when Penny tries to pull one on us. Uh, yeah. yeah, OK, yeah. then. You know what? Mm. You know what, Toko Loco? I know this is an ugly mm. T-shirt competition. Toko Loco nothing. So it's not too pretty? Toko Loco nothing until the cars are to Hello, the side. Can you please announce Am I dropping you home? Am I dropping you home? <laughs> can you let someone please while you deliberate? Wisely. Can, please deliberate and come and, and present this trophy quickly. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. She regrets to inform you that the dinosaur turtles and stuff and the. Toko Loco. Yeah. Come, Colin, come, Colin. Let's I'm put this song on, put this song on. Let's, I quit. Let's, let's, let's collect this award together. That's it. We have You're fired. No, we're going to collect, we're gonna collect this all award together. You know? You know? Okay. What's wrong with me? You know, oh, okay, good. We got this. And I would like to thank Kenny G for inspiring us last year mm -hmm. to do this presentation. Colin, me and you go sign this as, as the winning you and champions I. of 2022. Okay. Kenny, and, this one is for you. And just how Penny framed the Kenny G. Um, picture and put it in no, our house. Don't frame this. I hope Penny's going. Actually, Unless you know what? You we will frame this. We will frame it. Will frame it. Frame it. Don't worry about that. We'll so frame each year in Penny's house, she will have a memento from this fan right. from these fantastic right. Christmas. Right. And, right. Right. and we follow. We follow. And any footsteps are legends, Colin. Right. Colin, right. Okay. Is this time to go to a break now? I think so. Is it time for a break? I, I, hear, some I, hear, I, hear, I hear a doorbell. <laughs> I hear a break coming on. See you after the break, guys. <laughs> Got this feeling to high five the sun, dance in the rain, and have my scoop of fun. I'm on my way to flavor my day with something new, and I've got room for you. Let loose and live a little, get close and share a little. Join you, Creamery Novelties. Christmas coming here is all around. Christmas back in town. Christmas coming here is all around. Christmas is coming, and your fingers know it. For a finger licking good Christmas. KFC. I think some time more from me. Oh, 
me Christmas. Penny on point, this is the Parang Slide. So get ready, be playing all the instruments using your bodies, all right? Hear me now. Let's get this party started. Stand side by side. Get your body moving. Let's do the Parang Slide. Now your shoulders are the shack shack shaker. And your waist is the best. Yes, I got. Your feet are the tuck tuck. Now put a smile on your face. Quattro means four. We know those trees. Quattro, let me have one more. Mandolin is free. Style, style, style. Let's do the power and slide. Four steps forward. Take four steps forward. Quattro, quattro. Now four steps back. Quattro, quattro. Tick tock to the left. Tick tock to the right. Now shake it, shake, shake. Shake it, shake it. The waist is the base. Waist is the base. From side to side. Side to side. To the round to the left. Now everybody do the power and slide. Come on, Penny. Come on, Penny. Come on. One, two, three, four, and back. Three. Tick tock to the left. Tick tock to the right. I'm going to see if I can join. Shake the shock, shock. Look at the waist to the base. Oh, yes. Side to side. Side to the right. To the left. Yeah. That was nice, Penny. Ready for you. Ready for you. Ready for you. Let's go. Shoulders at the shack, shack. Shake it, shake it. Waist to the base. Waist to the base. Your feet at the top, top, top. Top time to mash up the place. Anyone can do it. Even Penny. There's nothing to it. Just stand up side by side. Going four steps forward, all right, Penny? Let's go. Take four steps forward. Quattro, quattro. No four steps back. Quattro, quattro. Tick tock to the left, tick tock to the right. Now shake it, shake, shake. Shake it, shake it. Your okay. waist to the base. Looking waist good. To the base. From side to side. Side to side. Turn around to the left. Now everybody, everybody do the power and slide. Yeah. <laughs> Luke, Rashad. And Josh, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Listen, for guys. Us. Thank I you. am predicting that this is going to be one of the must listen to and performances in terms of this new song, Parang Slide. Thank you for joining us on Pop. It so has been nice. great. We enjoyed La, La Mansion. We enjoyed Myron B. They were here with us. We had a time on today's show. It is, it's Christmas, and it's a beautiful Christmas. Beautiful. And thank you for joining us on Pop and just, so much for us just, for, just for sharing that beautiful Christmas spirit with us. All the best for um, 2023. Can you believe it? Oh, New Year. So, guys, on behalf of the cast and crew of Pop, Penny and Point, thank you so very much for watching the show for being a part of our extended family and just having fun with us. And all the best for 2023. Take it out. Let's go again. Let's go. Move it. Everybody move your waist to the base. Waist to the base. Waist to the base. Everybody move your waist to the base. Waist to the base. I like that. Waist to the base. Waist to the base. Waist to the base. Everybody move your waist to the base. Waist to the base. Waist to the base. Do it one more time, four steps forward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go. One more time, let me go. One, two, three. Take four steps forward. Quattro, quattro. Four steps back. Quattro, quattro. Tick tock to the left, tick tock to the right. Now shake it, shake, shake. Shake it, shake it. Waist to the base. Waist to the base. Side to side. Side to side. And around to the left. Now everybody do the power and slide. Woo!
Aqui a faina 